Should be a good one there. Off the mic segment real quick, Teddy. Scott Foster going to ref the game tonight with the Rockets and the Warriors. Hasn't worked a game since February 21st, and we keep on hearing. You see Daryl Moore. You see the ownership of Houston really getting after it here, Teddy. Is this in their mind? Because you brought up a pretty good topic a few moments ago here when you take a look at Do you want the team that's motivated to just try to win the game? Or do you want the other team on the other side saying, well, how are they going to call the game to see how we can exploit it? It's an interesting matchup. I love the fact that Foster is doing this game. Just adds to the intrigue. I think it's going to get a pretty good ratings number, and I'm interested, Teddy. <laughs> yeah, exactly. If, if you want to get the casual fans involved, let's get as yep. much controversy as we possibly can, load up on it, and, and then see uh, what we've got for uh, an intriguing ballgame. Remember, okay, Scott Foster was absolutely implicated in the Tim Donahue scandal. Tim Donahue, the only NBA ref to be disgraced for fixing games, okay? Foster implicated. Foster repeatedly on the phone with Donahue day after day. No investigation, <laughs> okay? And here it is, more than a decade later. There's always controversy with Scott Foster. Whenever he's on it. He shouldn't be refing these games. He really shouldn't. The NBA should know better. I know it's fun, but Scott Foster's got no business being here. And if I'm the Rockets, I don't blame you for being a little bit upset at the referee announcement for Tuesday night.